Hey friends, this is Dom from Northgard and in just a few days we will release our brand new single Dominion of Cain. Today we are here to talk a little bit about the background of the single. So why is it called Dominion of Cain? Most of you, if not all, know the story of Cain and Abel and the current circumstances all around the globe the negativity everywhere led me to the point when I decided to write lyrics about Cain. Because to me, in this particular context, Cain symbolizes this kind of negativity. And of course, we also wanted to have a fitting cover artwork. So the cover artwork has been released a few days ago. In the center, you can see Cain and a lot of other human beings suffering, which in my opinion symbolizes or transfers the, the feeling of the song, of the single, of the lyrics, just perfect. The cover was done again by Michael Lorenk from Poland. He already did the light crawler cover and it's super nice to work with him. From the very first moment, he knew exactly what I wanted to have. Because if you compare the artworks of Lightcrawler and Dominion of Cain, you will see that Lightcrawler has a more modern attempt than Dominion of Cain. Also some old kind of vibes. This is, of course, due to the fact that we are not singing about a super modern topic. Of course, it's modern. But also Cain is historically related and so we we decided to give the cover artwork some kind of a fresque style and i think it turned out just great like for many north god songs if not for most uh, we produced it by ourselves so we recorded it here in my studio i mixed it and eventually also mastered it because we had a really clear view on how the sound should turn out. It should be aggressive, it should be the right sound for the lyrics for this kind of single. What can you expect? Um, it, it will be a pretty heavy song. It, it's fast, it's got some nice up mid-tempo vibes and um, especially the guitars I think are pretty heavy. We recorded it, uh, we have recorded it many times to check out, uh, uh, re-recorded it or re-amped, uh, so to speak, uh, with the, uh, many different amplifiers to figure out which can deliver this aggressiveness. Also the bass, line is, uh, bass lines are pretty heavy and of course there are also um, many, many orchestra tracks. So many tracks. I would like to show you a little bit how many tracks we have in this particular single. Um, so we have more, uh, 150 tracks here. So I hope you can see it a little bit. Um, many guitar tracks, many uh, keyboard tracks, etc., etc. Um, yeah, so it was nice, but also a little bit challenging. Anyway, there is not just a new song coming up, but also a new video. And the video was done again by the fantastic Dream Film Factory from Bavaria in Germany, who already did the Lightcrawler video. And the video in for Dominion of Cain was pretty much finished before we <laughs> before we finished the mix and master um, but this was also due to the fact we needed some nice weather conditions nice in <laughs> is a good word word here um, we had the perfect weather conditions for this dark theme and dark topic so make sure to check it out what I expect or how I see the progress of the, the last few years. We are super, super, super grateful for all the great 
feedback we received for Lightcrawler. I mean, it will reach the 1 million plays on Spotify soon, um, which is just awesome. And we hope that you will like um, Dominion of Kane as well. So make sure to pre-save the single. Release date is 15th of October. And make also sure to check out the video once it is out. So I hope you got some nice impressions and stay tuned just a few more days and see you soon.